Uh, hi, uh, Peter Keynes from Agri Exchange in Renmark, South Australia. I've been a Centec dealer for about 13 years. Okay, so what we have here is an open soil pit. And the, the idea here is just to demonstrate where the sensors will sit uh, compared to the relative soil layers. So we have good, uh, nice light, uh, good healthy soil in the top to 25 to 30 centimetres here. So the idea here is to get at least one or two sensors in this top section uh, where most of the roots will be. We have a rubbly layer here at 50 centimetres and a heavy clay layer down here at 80 centimetres. One sensor at 50 centimetres to uh, monitor for any drainage past the root zone and any extra water use that the trees might get some water out of here and then uh, a sensor at 80 centimetres in the, in the heavy clay to um, just check for any potential water tables that might come up from underneath. Well, it's a bit the same thing. What I've actually done, this is easy, this is a little bit harder to see the layers on but I've actually skimmed it back and there's a layer there, there there, there and there. So there's one, two, three, four, five layers here that are quite clear to see. Now I've drawn the lines across it's even easier. So I'm grabbing a fifth sensor and that is the sensor. The, the idea here is just to show the, the different layers. Quite a nice sandy profile on the top. And then it moves into a, a, a slightly heavier loamy clay textured profile. Then we move into a, a medium clay with some carbonate and, and more clay and carbonate below that. So on this site we would put at least a one metre probe but include five sensors. And we'd have a sensor at 10 centimetres in this nice loamy profile. Two in the, the main part of the root zone. We think here the root zone may be as deep as 60 centimetres. And then a sensor at maybe 80 and 100 centimetres to monitor for a little bit deeper drainage on this particular site.